Now to a story you will only see on Western Mass News Sunday morning. Police say a human skull was found in the woods off of Herrick Road in Blanford. One Blanford family has confirmed to Western Mass News that it is their relative. Milton Eldridge went missing from that area five years ago. The family spoke exclusively with Western Mass News reporter Audrey Russo. She has the details. I was in love with him since I met him in the late 80s. Karen Bashinsky lives on Herrick Road in Blanford. For years, she dated Milton Eldridge, a redheaded prankster with a passion for nature. Milton's daughter, Renee, shares his red hair and love for the outdoors. We went hiking on a regular basis. We used to climb the bugle in Gilbertville. But the family says Milton struggled with opioid addiction in the early 2000s. I was just waiting for him to come home to me, and he did. And, um, in 2014. On June 20th, 2014, Karen says Milton left her home on Herrick Road to go for a walk, the last time she ever saw him alive. He he had been extremely depressed and I'm mad at myself because I thought I should have made him go to a psych hospital. The hours and days turned into weeks and months without hearing from him. He never just disappeared and didn't call or contact any of us. And despite the posters and missing person alerts, those months without Milton became five years. I had already decided that he was dead because I couldn't live with the idea of him being in this world and not in contact with his grandchildren. It's always been a thing that they'd known that grandpa is missing. Police say a human skull was discovered in this portion of the woods on Herrick Road on Sunday morning. Karen says shortly afterwards she was asked for Milton's dental records. I just kind of was glad that there was a cop there who gave a care. Tuesday afternoon, the family confirmed to Western Mass News that police told them the skull matched Milton's dental records. Renee says they had told police Milton regularly walked through that area of the woods, and they feel his disappearance didn't receive enough attention from law enforcement. It just doesn't seem like anything was ever really searched. Five years later, and the family can't forget the searching for a man lost in the nature he loved so well. I don't know, the word closure is just so weird. I, there's none of that. But I just, I just want people to care about them. In Blanford, Audrey Russo, Western Mass News.